Why are hospitals in a very good position for solar system? Uh, it is very important and it is a well-known fact that hospitals need a constant electricity. But before we talk much, let us go straight forward into um, the process of installing solar system or solar panels in a hospital. First of all, the first step is to assess the site and determine the optimal location for the panels. This includes considering factors such as roof orientation, shading, and space. Once the location has been determined, the panels are then mounted on the roof or ground and connected to an inverter. This inverter converts the DC electricity generated by the panels into AC electricity that can be used in the hospital. Finally, the system, the system is then connected into electrical grid and the hospital can start benefiting from the clean and renewable energy generated by the panels. All inside this place, we have the grid and we have the batteries all connected and we have all that is needed well uh, arranged and also connected together and thus the hospital is now fully electrified and this system provides electricity 247 as you can see the schematics that is displayed here it is the same format that is just required and then you're good to go and the whole hospital is fully electrified both in every department places like operation theater icu are one of the major places where we need constant electricity as you can see in this case we have our anesthesia workstation which is now solar powered and then from the previously i showed you the ot dump here is also electrified and then also we have the suction machine also here and also we have some other medical equipment as you can see there is a uh, radiant warmer all these are equipment that during operation or during surgical procedures they are all needed thus they need electrification 